Hello peeps, welcome back to my channel. So winter got to me a little bit and I was feeling gloomy most of the days, very low in energy or wanting to do anything apart from work. However, I put together this video uh, where I just put together all the, um, all the creative things that I've done over the last few weeks. This video has three parts. We have painting a mirror, one. Then I share how I made the creative jar that's full of inspiration when you need some. And then part three is all about crocheting. So let's get into the video. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy 2022. Welcome to my channel. I honestly miss making videos. Also, is my room echoey? I feel amazing. I had a call with a client and he likes the designs. Uh, it's always a good feeling when you just nail down the initial steps of a design and then you're on the same page and I can do my beautiful things. This is the mirror we're working with. So the idea is that these lights don't work anymore. So we're just gonna paint over them. Here's a mood board of what I want it to be like. I think blue would look beautiful. So I'm not gonna lie, my room was a mess up until this morning and I was feeling very stressed. And then I remembered that Jordan Peterson says you need to clean up your room because it's an extension of how you feel and who you are. And it's so basic, but I honestly feel so much better. So I guess we're going for this. I feel like this is a mirror that Lizzie McGuire would absolutely love. Like it would fit in her room, so. Also, I'm using acrylic paint, uh, which is easily removable from glass in case. I don't think this mirror will be ever fixed. Just, you know, talking between me and you, no one's gonna fix the mirror. So I think it's good, but I don't want to use permanent one. So my hand is shaky and I'm doing it and I'm doing it, and okay. Look at that, not that bad. Um, loving this. Not loving the rest. Honestly, that's the only thing I so, like. I think this is the before. Paintings from October, like, I guess. Table area and the mirror. I am not loving how it looks, but I don't want the other paintings. I think it's time for them to go, so... But I think the theme is like, not finished and that's something that I like. It's like time will come, you know? Time will come to finish these paintings. This is the most important thing, this. Lavender blue, beautiful color. It's in all of my paintings and I think I think it's going on the mirror. The problem is that I don't have that much. Uh, we'll try to recreate this color and then I'll start painting while it's still light, so that I can post beautiful content for you guys. You know, the problem is I always want to make very high quality videos. I feel like this is like a makeup tutorial, but instead of makeup, I'm mixing paint. So I feel like I don't make a lot of videos because I want like the best quality, the best microphone. And then I keep thinking like, what's best to upload one video that's that I think is great because it has good quality and hey, look at that angle where I filmed it or just create. And of course, like put more effort, wow. Can you tell I've been like, I can't think. I think I've had way too many hours at the computer, hello. 
So I think for 2022, I'll just create. And I think I'll be much more happier with a bit, you know, a bit more videos, but a bit less, not quality. I mean, I feel like could be worse, you know, it could always be worse. Okay. So I'm adding like the tiniest amount of blue. And I think even that was too much. Yep. Okay, what are we thinking? Okay, so I added a lot of black actually and l lilac. It's kind of a blue, but like lilac, but you can barely tell that it's lilac. Um, and it's a bit gray. And um, now we'll paint this. Uh huh. Check. Uh, I'm trying to bring it to fruition. Why these dudes be steady wishing? I'll be steady in the kitchen. I'll be cooking. I'll be shopping. I'll be flowing. I'll be spinning. Are you ready to see the beautiful mirror? I love it. Even though it's super tiny now because of all the like the lamps and just right here, but I like it. It's beautiful. It's my color. The only thing I need to repaint tomorrow because um, you can see the marker. It's a Thursday. Before I do some painting, I thought I would share what this is. Um, I want to, you know, sometimes I want to paint something or draw and I don't know what. So I decided to come up with this jar. It will have four colors. So we have blue and blue is places. Then items is gray. Green is like living beings or just like people or anything alive. And then yellow is just something very random like at any point when i want to get some inspiration for painting or drawing i will just pick out one or all four and then try to come up with something so I am knitting a jumper and I actually started one before I didn't like the colors so now we have I already have the back um, very excited so back then I started part of the first it's gonna be a cardigan so this is one part and then also I started a sleeve. Um, I absolutely love the colors. Um, it's 100% wool, so I don't know how nice it's gonna be, but look, it's my first ever sleeve. So I hope to finish it in a week or so because I want to wear it while it's still actually winter. How is everyone doing in the new year? Um, I'm feeling very sleepy and tired, so very low vibes. Yeah, I started crocheting um, as a way to get away from the computer. Okay, so editing Carly in here. For two minutes, I explained Pomodoro technique, pretty much. 25 minutes you work, five minutes you get off. Amazing tool for doing tasks, uh, keeping up with the time, and you can keep your focus levels at a real high. So try Pomodoro, it's a Google Chrome plugin, love it. And I'll try to use it for a month and then give you like a big update uh, how it has maybe changed my life. So, okay, back to the video. So let me show you. Um, 
this is my sketch. I know, much profesh. Um, but maybe you can see here better. So this is how it looks. The back and the front. So it will have two panels, long arms, and the back will be just like this. And I have this one cardigan that I absolutely love. So I use that as kind of the the base i would say and i think it's very nice and cozy and it actually looks exactly like my art wait where is it can you see the green the blue the gray i feel like i'm slowly becoming just my artwork like i wear the same things um okay i'll do a few lines of this and then I hope I have some time to paint.